Hi everyone, it's Becca again. So today I will be doing a what's in my bag video. I love watching these videos from time to time. They're really cool and I just got a new purse so uh, I couldn't resist. So anyway, this is, I will show you my old purse. This is my Michael Kors old purse that I got TJ Maxx because I'm cheap and um, I, love, I love Michael Kors but I do not pay full price for it. Sorry, the sun's going down a little bit even though it's like 11 a.m. <laughs> um, actually it's noon. But I don't know why the sun just went down, so sorry about that. But anyway, it looks like it's back now. And so this is my old purse. Um, I definitely love the cross bodies. Those are my favorite. I loved this purse. I'm so sad to be parting with it, but the leather is kind of going. I've had it for a couple years now. This keeps going and breaking, and my mom keeps fixing it. Um, but anyway, I love they had some zippers here. It had this pouch here, the pouch back here, and then inside it had a little pouch it was just a really all-around great purse, and I'm really sad to be parting with it because I love the blue color. But, um, sorry, I just threw it over there, but it was awesome. But anyway, I've been on the lookout for a new purse because I was in desperate need. And um, I love the Michael Kors one, so I wanted to get another Michael Kors one. But, like I said, I don't pay full price for those because they're way too expensive. Um, so this, I'll show you what it is. It's this one. It originally was uh, $2.98, but I got it at TJ Maxx for $179.99. There's my tag. I kept it just for you guys. Um, so still quite expensive, but I think it's worth it. I was looking for a uh, blue or a black, but the one they had that I really liked, this one was brown. So I went with it. So this is what it looks like. I really like that it has a handle that you can put kind of, you know, just on your shoulder, which I don't normally do the bad shoulder so I don't normally carry my bags like that but it also has a cross body but I just like the option so excuse my belly with my shirt but there's what it looks like and you can adjust it right here which is really nice um, so anyway this is what it looks like the tassel right here is not my favorite but I don't mind it um, what's really cool is this whole top section until all the way down is a pocket and I will try to find the name of this bag and link it down below. I know they still sell this bag. Um, I've seen it at stores before. I just saw it actually recently at Macy's. My other one I would have loved to get, but I don't think they sell that anymore. So anyway, when you open it, so I love that the pocket's down there. So in the pocket, um, and here's the inside, what it looks like has the MK right there. And what's really cool, hold on, let me get it. It's really cool. Um, when I purchased this, it actually came with the dust bag that says Michael Kors in a nice silver, and which was amazing. I That hadn't happened with my last bag. And it comes with the um, Michael Kors card that tells you all about the leather and how to take care of it and whatnot. But I really like the dust bag. I'm very excited for that. Um, so anyway, like I was saying, in this back pocket right here, I have my checkbook. <laughs> very important. Um, and I have this, this was from an Ipsy bag a long time ago, I just keep some feminine products, some pads in there, um, just for on the go, because you never know. So let me zip that back up. Now, there's this main pocket with a little zipper compartment back in there, and this kind of buttoned compartment. So, I will do the main compartment first. I have my sunglasses. These are actually some new prescription sunglasses I just got. So let me show you what they look like. I really like them. Um, I think they look decent with my face shape, but they're polarized and they're my prescription sunglasses, so they're great. And like I said, they're new, they're from L. So that's cool. And in there, I, in this little container, I just keep a wiping thing for them. So, uh, let me put that back. Then I have my wallet. Um, this is just this is Liz Claiborne. I'm sure I got it at TJ Maxx or Marshalls. And I will open it up for you guys. Um, cover up my license. But I just have cards, more cards, more slots, money, except I have no money in there. Really, I have zero dollars in there because um, I just went shopping. Um, so that's cool. Here's the original price tag. Okay, great. This says it's the Bedford Luggage. Bedford? Bedford? Uh, is that what it's called? 
there's what it looks like. I have a business card from my dermatologist in there because um, I just went to go see him. Okay, um, I have this lip product I have to return. If you saw my haul, um, you know what color this is and uh, the story behind it. If not, I will link, I'll leave that link down below. Oh great, okay, I have some trash. I have some gum. Let me throw this, there's just a gum wrapper. A receipt, because I went shopping like I said, for Qdoba. It was my first time going, it was really good. I was pleasantly surprised. I have my um, headphones, my Apple headphones. If you guys know how to store these so they don't get tangled, please let me know. I saw a trick. Apparently you can use a um, clothespin. I think it was a BuzzFeed video, but now I forget what video that was, so I've forgotten <laughs> um, how to do that. I have another lip product. This is what I wore yesterday when I went shopping. This is the Too Faced Melted Liquefied Longwear Lipstick in Melted Fuchsia. I love this color. I have a hand cream. I actually bought this when I was in Hong Kong um, last January. This is the L'Occitane en Provence, or L'Occitane as people say. Um, Pivoine? Flora? Pivoine Flora um, hand cream. So I really like that. It's a really nice florally scent. Have some tissues because you never know when you're going to need some tissues. Okay, I have 50 cents just hanging around there. 50 cents, 50 cents. Let me put that in my wallet. I love that. Love some good quarters. I have a uh, movie ticket for Tomorrowland. <laughs> More trash. Um, and it has this really nice strap in here which is really nice. Um, I guess if you want to clip your keys or your wallet or something so you won't lose it, um, which is nice. I have this toothpick. Then in the little zippered compartment, I have hair elastics, little like um, floss picks, um, some more of those, uh, what do you call those, toothpicks. And then um, as some of you may know, I mentioned it in one of my videos, I forget which one, I used to be a VIB Rouge member, and when be you become a VIB Rouge member, they give you this nice little compact, and it's a magnified, sorry, I don't want that to blind you, but, oh, you can see all my stuff there, but it's a magnified, no, 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 a magnified mirror, a really nice mirror, so nice that I keep it in my wallet, and it's so funny, I'll show you what it comes with. It says, Dear VIB Rouge, thank you for being one of our best clients. Beauty addiction looks good on you. Happy holidays for Beauty Insider Team. So, um, I just kept that. Oh, and it's on. It's in French in the back, which is cool. Um, I just kept that because I loved it so much about the beauty addiction looks good on you. Um, I love to have that, like, as a shirt or something. I just think that's so cute. And there's a sticker that says, let me try to get it off. So this purse is new, like I said, um, and it had this sticker that said 180 on it. I don't know if that was from the TJ Maxx headquarters, if that was their 180th bag of these they had, or is from Michael Kors, I'm not sure, but it was a sticker nonetheless, I just took that off. Okay, let me just put everything back in there. Now in this front section, I'll show you what I have. They have some slots for your cards. I don't think you'll be able to see that. They have some slots for your cards, which I think is cool, but I don't use. I just have some Benadryl because I have allergies. Um, I have some cough drops. I oh, They're kind of dusty and dirty. Probably actually should switch these out for some new ones. They were in my old purse, and I just switched them over. But they're the Ricola Honey Lemon, which are my favorite. I have my Handy Dandy Birth Control. Um, I don't know why I keep it in my purse, but just in case, like, I go somewhere or whatever, I'm out late, um, I just like to keep it with me. I have a pen. It's from my bank. They're really nice pens. I have the CVS Pharmacy... I stumbled over that. <laughs> Excuse me. I have the CVS Pharmacy Extra Strength Pain Relief Tablets, but I just keep really refilling it with my own. I have some, actually, CVS brand um, Tylenol and then some Aleve. Because I get headaches quite often and I just li like having this small little size. My school ID in here. Um, I won't show that just for my privacy. I have 
this Pro Air. <laughs> I'm trying to describe this to you guys. This is just my inhaler. Um, my rescue inhaler in case I need it. I have this Tide to Go stick. This comes in handy. Doesn't, you know, get off all of... If you have some, like, oil or something, it doesn't always get off everything. But it's quite handy. This is one of my favorite perfumes, and I only have it in a roller ball. But once I finish, once I get through this, I will... Um, re I will purchase the big size, and it's the Aqua de Gioa Giorgio Armani perfume. <sighs> Just smells so lovely. It smells like the beach, and and not I don't mean coconut by that. I just oh, it's just a great, great summertime perfume, and I always bring it with me everywhere. I've actually brought it on planes with me before because I just keep it in my bag, and I always forget. So I'm glad that it's um under the that uh, limit. This I've had forever too, but I really like it, but I always forget that it's in here. It's the Neutrogena Revitalizing Lip Balm. This is what it looks like. I love that it kind of has this oval shape to it, and I'm not sure the color I have. I guess I messed it come off. I'm sorry about that. I have these picks for your teeth. They're really helpful, especially for my lower teeth. Um, my front, like, six teeth right here, I have a bar. I'm six or four, whatever, whatever it is. Um, I have a uh, permanent retainer in there, so things that the f those floss picks can't get, these can. I have some tums because I have lots of stomach aches all the time. Um, I have this sugar, f this this fresh sugar rose lip treatment. It's just a mini one. I think this was the one that came in the. Um, uh, it was the birthday gift a couple years ago. I love these. Um, I like the tinted ones, but my favorite is the original, which I used up while I was in Hong Kong. And um, once I go through some of my other lip balms, I will definitely be repurchasing that because it is very um, luxurious, is how I would describe it. This is kind of weird, but I do have some condoms in here. Not for myself, but um, for lots of other people in case they need them. I'm a college student, so um, my college gives them out for free, so I just keep them in here. And you know, you never know when someone's going to need them, and if I can help prevent a pregnancy, why not? Um, I have a band aid. Should probably get some more of those. I have some wet wipes because those are great. And the last thing I have in here is a soft lips um, lip balm in Jelly Bean, and it has SPF 20. Um, I love these lip balms. They're great. Jelly Bean's not my favorite scent, but I think I got it in a kit. Don't really let me put all that back. Keep dropping everything here. Don't really have a desk. It's over there. Um, but anyway, um, I hope you guys liked that video. Kind of something a little different. Like I said, I really like watching other people's What's in My Bag um, videos. And since I got a new one, I just couldn't resist. Um, I really do like this bag, and I hope it lasts me for another couple years. Um, so anyway, if you did like this video, please give me a thumbs up and subscribe. It's free. And until next time, bye guys.